when you say something, make sure it counts for something. Okay. If you're going to expend energy talking, make sure that it's valuable. Right. If there's nothing to say, just shut the f- <laughs> So I just operate in a way where if I have something to say, I say it. And I measure it by three metrics. Is it kind? Is it necessary? And is it true? Yeah. If it's either, if it doesn't match all three categories, I'll most likely avoid it. It needs to be kind. And kind doesn't mean nice, like how people think kind. Is it necessary? Like, is it the right time to say this? Is yeah. it the right context? And is it true? Mm. And based off of that three metrics is kind of how I operate. So I think, is this kind, necessary, and true before I say something? If I think it filters through that, I voice it. So right. people need to have filtration systems and understand that the emotions that they feel mm. throughout like an op, like a, a download of information or throughout a conversation or a yeah. disagreement, that emotion isn't you. Yeah you are yourself experiencing an emotion, Mm. but you can place yourself as a third party viewing the emotion and ask Mm. yourself, why am I feeling this way? And is my response to the situation gonna be kind? And is how I'm going to approach it necessary? And is what I'm going to say true? Because many times we deceive ourselves into believing that we have the right operation and mindset and that we're on the right side of the problem or the situation or the conversation. And many times we're not. So those are the metrics that I use on a mental basis. To nice. Check it's good that you have this kind of system in place. And like what you said, I think it's very true about like, you need to realize like when you think I am angry, it's not that you are angry, but you're experiencing anger. Not that you're engulfed by the emotion. So that's a good mindset shift.